Hey guys, welcome to the 14th HTML editing and programming tutorial. And in this tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to do a non script tag, which basically is used to define an alternate text if the script is, will not, uh, is not executed. And uh, usually the tag is used for browsers that, re that recognize the script tag but do not support the script inside of them. So the browsers will display the text inside the non script tag instead. However, if a browser supports the script inside the script tag, uh, basically the non-script tag or no script tag excuse me will be ignored so you won't have to worry about it so I'm gonna show you guys the example of a JavaScript with a no script tag and a VB script with a uh, no script tag and I will be doing VB script and JavaScript tutorials separately <clears throat> from HTML so uh, watch out for that so let's get started here okay so we're just gonna basically do a <coughs> um, uh, example here. So let's do script. And uh, what? Well, I need to get my cursor in there. Let's do script. And then we'll do. Then we do type equals text slash Java script. And then end your quotations and end that. So basically, and then we got to go down the line. And this, we type in one of those, uh, one of the uh, tag lines, and then we do an exclamation point, dash, dash. So what that basically does, it tells it to go read the script, and this is the comment in for the script. So, all right. And we'll go down one more line. Then, then we're going to do document, dot, write, and then type in your parameters, hello, world ah. world okay so basically this is your comment for the HTML so it's gonna the document is gonna write hello world and remember you always have to put them in quotations otherwise the script will not work so let's go down another line and then we'll go slash slash dash dash end it and then that basically ends the comment right here it just ends it right it just ends this tag that we started and ends it right there so now we got to end our script so slash script all right now <coughs> put a no script tag so no script then space no then we'll put type in your browser doesn't like you <laughs> and then and your no script tag which no script there we go so that's basically a no script tag so what the no script tag does is if your document document in your web page does not support the script of javascript what basically it does is it doesn't it takes this since it cannot read the comments inside of the javascript what it does is take the no script tag and it takes the <clears throat> what you type in between the tags and actually shows you that instead of showing this so if your if your browser doesn't support JavaScript which I think all of them do now um, it if it can if it doesn't support it it will not write hello world it will write your browser does not like you so alright so let's view it so I'm gonna file and I'm gonna save it as uh, script again save it as script dot uh, HTML save and then I'm gonna hit F11 for preview and browser and here it is hello world so my bad browser basically does support JavaScript, so it did not write the no script. So, all right, let's go back here, and now I'm going to show you guys a. So basically, take out JavaScript and then put VB script, which basically, what VB script is, it'll it's the same. It's like it's another scripting language, but I'll go over VB script in a VB in VB in my VB script tutorials. And I'll also go over JavaScript in my JavaScript tutorials, but we'll just keep it simple for now, and just say the VB script is uh, it's like JavaScript almost, but a little different. So if your browser doesn't support VB script, it will not write this. It'll just go to the non-script, uh, no script, and just write your browser does not like you. So let's see if my browser supports it. Tools, uh, no view, preview, and browser default, and apparently it did not write anything. So all right, so my browser does not support VB script, so it didn't write anything. 
which I don't know why, but, um, oh, yeah, it write, wrote that because it didn't write anything because it doesn't have anything to write. This, this doesn't, this just tells you your browser doesn't like you and all that stuff, so it just basically has no script in it, and it doesn't have anything to write in it. So my browser does not support VB script, which I'll go over in more detail later on in my VB script tutorials. So that's how you do JavaScript and VBScript no script tags. This is how you do no script tags, and just watch out for my next tutorial um, for other stuff. Uh, it'll be URLs and all that. Okay, let's go over this script, which basically it just defines a script. The tag no script defines an alternate text if the script is not executed. And here's some more stuff that I did not tell you, but and I don't really want to go over this because my video is getting a little long. So I'm just going to tell you what it is. So the uh, tag object defines an embedded object. Uh, tag param defines runtime settings for an object. Applet uh, depreciated use object tag instead. So, okay. Yeah, that's basically it. And I'll see you guys in the next tutorial. All right, guys. Bye.